Hey, what's going on, everybody? How's it going? John here with another video. Hope you guys are all doing well. Keeping your vibrations way up high to the roof, to the sky, and above. So my message today is it's time to get yourself back up. Just pick yourself back up, whatever you're going through. Maybe if you messed up on something, you made a mistake. You relapsed from an addiction. Don't, it's no, it's no time. Accept that it happened. And just learn from it, grow from it. Pick yourself back up. Don't let these chains hold you down. Especially in these big, powerful times we're in. It's time to pick yourself up. That's how we level up. By picking ourselves back up. If we just pout and groan and this and that, stay in that third dimensional low vibration, emotions, feeling sorry for ourselves 24-7, you're not going to evolve. You're not. It's time to pick yourself back up. It's time to evolve, to keep growing. And times like this is to focus on your shadow work. Fix the dark side of yourself. Like your old habits, the old version of yourself. It's time to put that aside and behind you. That's your past. It's time for new beginnings. New doors opening. So if you, if you messed up on something, or you made mistakes, or you screwed up, or relapsed or whatever anything that you anything that just anything that's lowering your vibration pick yourself back up just pick yourself up you you always got to pick yourself up you got to that's how you keep going in life that's how you keep moving forward because if you don't, you just keep looking back. You keep looking back at your old self. When you pick yourself up, you're saying goodbye to your old self. Here's your new self. You're working towards a new version of yourself when you pick yourself back up. When you learn to accept things the way they are. You got to learn. You got to learn. Life is learn. Life is all about learning. Every day. Every day is a battle. Every day is spiritual warfare. You learn from what you've done. You learn and you learn and you learn. So. Sorry, my cat. I'm at my dad's house. I don't want my cat to interrupt. And it's also thundering outside. I, just, I saw a... a Double rainbow earlier. That thing was so bright and beautiful. I've been seeing so many rainbows today. I'm not even kidding. I was watering the plants because I'm dog sitting at my dad's for the weekend. I saw a rainbow over the sprinkler. I saw so many rainbows. Like, wow. And then I saw a double rainbow. I'm like, geez. Signs for new beginnings. If you see a rainbow, I see that as a spiritual thing. If you see rainbows... Or like rainbows, multiple rainbows in a day. I feel like that's a big spiritual sign, spiritually. That new beginnings are coming. New doors are coming and opening and manifesting. That you're, yeah, you're on the way to new beginnings. And that's kind of my point on this video. When you pick yourself back up, you're on the way to new beginnings. When you accept for what you've done, when you're saying goodbye to your old self, and when you're growing, evolving, new beginnings are coming your way. But first, before that happens, once you pick yourself back up, you gotta you gotta learn to accept. Accept, learn, and grow. That's how you evolve. I know that's a, I say that over and over, but that's the truth. That's the truth with all this. You've got to evolve. 
That's the only way you're going to grow spiritually is you're going to evolve. Because if you keep making the same mistake over and over and over and you keep staying in that low vibrational emotions, you're not going to evolve. you got to learn to accept. Think what you did the previous time and change it. Change has to occur too. Change in acceptance. Acceptance of self. And it's all a process. It's not a race. It's, we got to learn. We're put in different situations in order to learn from and grow. But picking yourself back up. It does feel good to pick yourself back up. I'm not going to lie. But that's the thing. It's your higher self motivating you. When you feel that energy and motivation, pick yourself back up and try again. And actually work on yourself. That's your higher self motivating you. When you have that feeling not to pick yourself back up, that's your ego saying, stay in this emotion. Stay low. Stay in this third dimensional of emotions. But... Remember, there's always a new version of yourself waiting on you all the time because that's how we grow learn every day learn from the different mistakes that we've made because if we don't learn we're not going to evolve of course but when we learn because life is like a school to level up to the next grade the more you learn and improve and work on yourself, you're going to level up even more and more and more. Keep raising your vibration, staying happy, staying positive. Yeah, there's got to be a balance with your emotions as long as you don't stay in them, but that's just how it is. There has to be a balance. And you got to learn to control your ego, even in times like this. when all the ener I know all the energy is all crazy right now. The energy is very intense right now. Very intense. But we are growing collectively. I can feel we are growing collectively. Like, wow. It's just... It's just don't let your ego get to you in times like this. There's no time to sit in depression or just sit and feel sorry for yourself. You just got to learn and deal with it. Learn and accept. Just have acceptance. And times like this, be thankful for what you have. Be thankful for the things you have. Just be thankful that you're here in the moment. That's why the present moment is so important. So precious. Because that's what life should be about. Being in the moment. Don't take things for granted. Being thankful. Because you're missing out when you take things for granted. But just hang in there. Whatever you're going through. Get back up. Get yourself back up. Keep moving. Keep moving forward. Don't stop. Don't look back. Looking back, you're looking at the old version of yourself. You move forward, you're moving forward to the new version of yourself. Because that's how you're growing and growing and growing. But, yeah. By the way, last Sunday, I actually had my first meditation session at a group. It's called, uh, it's this meetup app. And we meet at a park every other Sunday. And I did my first meditation with the group. Because one of the other, the other instructors couldn't make it. So they asked if I could fill in. Because I've told them I've had experience with meditation. So... It went very well. I'm very proud of myself for having for manifesting this. Because I've always wanted to actually meditate with a group. Like do a guided meditation for a group. Because that's why I want to be a meditation coach. And I'm not giving up on that. I'm still working my way towards that. And this is a start. And I'm very proud of myself for moving into this big step. I'm telling you, manifestation works as long as you put your energy towards it. It's there for you. You just got to figure out how to get to it. 
But yeah, I just want to make this quick video and I will talk to you guys later.